Good day, Divine Beings. Welcome. So grateful you're here. Thank you for watching this video. Starting off today, we are going to talk about Big Breath. Big Breath is a technique that I have learned, practiced, um, studied, and written down. And I've shared it with a lot of people, and they asked me to make a video on it. So today, this is the video on Big Breath. Big Breath is a breathing technique to help you expand your lungs to help open yourself up, to help you breathe in a really good way. So I'm going to kind of read what I have written and kind of walk us through the exercises of big breath. So the power is in the breath. Stretch with focus, depending, deepening, <laughs> deepening the stretch by relaxing, using nasal inhales to filter the air. Each and every breath can deepen a stretch in any pose. So I recommend for the first time that maybe you're laying down or sitting a spot where you won't fall over. Um, big breath technique, depending on what your breathing exercises are, could help you to pass out. So um, I really recommend you trying this in a position where you're not going to fall and hit your head. <laughs> so disclaimer. Um, starting out with a four to four count. That means inhale for four. One, two, three, four. Hold for two. One, two. Exhale. One, two, three, four. Hold. One, two. Got it? And then, you know, you start over again. And so you can gradually increase your count as you go, as you practice. You know, you can go for eight, four, eight, four, and whatnot. So leaving it up to you. So we're going to start with the breathe big gratitude. So inhale, a big, huge breath in of gratitude through the nose. <sighs> Exhale, big breath out of gratitude. Thankful for life's gift. Inhale, big breath in of gratitude. Exhale. Breathing out, relaxing into thankfulness. Right now we're not practicing the hold. Right now we're just practicing on inhaling. We're going to go through and get into the other steps later. So that's the big breath of gratitude. Always start with that gratitude. Always have that gratitude. Keep your um, spine straight. Keep your shoulders rolled back. Inhale gratitude, exhale gratitude. What does that mean? Thankfulness, being thankful, gratitude, being grateful. So just inhaling the feeling of gratefulness through your nose. Exhaling the thankfulness out through your mouth or your nose, whatever you'd like. The next one is big breath lengthen. So we're going to lengthen our breath. Each inhale, longer. Each exhale, longer. Slowly inhale a huge breath of gratitude. Keep going. Inhale more. Inhale more. Exhale big gratitude. Breathe out slowly. Blow out more. Blow out more. Slowly lengthening into breath's expansion. I've been practicing this one for a long time, so I can take a big breath in. Keep inhaling, allowing yourself to receive that. When you relax, it helps you to inhale more. And then when you breathe out, when you breathe out, keeping your shoulders still back, breathing out from your stomach. Pushing, pushing the air out. 
All right. Big breath, lung expansion. Inhale from the chest, expanding the upper, the middle, and the lower parts of the lungs, relaxing the stomach. Exhale from the lowest stomach muscles, keeping the chest expanded, vertebrae stacked. Inhale, heart forward, rolling shoulders back, expanding the chest and the lungs beyond perceived limits. Exhale from the lowest stomach muscles, pushing all the air out of the lungs. <sighs> inhale as much as perceived possible. And inhale a little bit more. Exhale as much as perceived possible. Then exhale a little more. Inhale, deep, soft, long breath. Pushing past the pain releases the tension. Exhale, relaxing like never before. So it's good to watch this video, um, check it out, and, and then go at your own pace. This is written in the Earth Hug Yoga series, which is available on Amazon. You can find it by looking up David Kenneth Swinson on Amazon. And you can look up my Earth Hug series. And the Big Breath technique is in there. Or you can also purchase it on its own. So that was the Big Breath Lung Expansion. So we're really just flexing and expanding ourselves. We're stretching ourselves from the inside. And while we do that, we want to roll the shoulders back. Feel that expansion. Feel this grow and feel it push when we breathe in. And then when you breathe out, keep this big still. Keep it rolled out. Keep this still big. When we blow out, blow out from here. Starting here. <laughs> Next will be the hold it. So in between those big, big, big breaths, we want to hold it. We want to pause. On the big, big, big inhale, and you're done inhaling, you've inhaled a little bit more, now you're done inhaling, hold it. Relax. Relax the stomach and just hold it. Find the way to lock yourself so that you're holding it with the least amount of muscles and then releasing it. And exhale fully, pushing all the air out. Sometimes you can, you know, go down to so really push all of it out. All of it, all of it, all of it, and stop. Hold it. Start getting dizzy, inhale. Either way, either way you're going, if you start getting dizzy, change your breath and start breathing. Just breathe again normally. After you start really stretching and you're really pushing it, just breathe again normally, relaxed, okay? So we're relaxing into the stretch. Is, is the importance of this. So we learn to breathe big, stretch it, breathe with gratitude, stretch it, and now hold it. Now exhale big, exhale big, exhale big. Hold it. Relax. Relaxing on the transition of holding the breath on inhale and exhale. Tell the tension to relax, allowing the muscles to release stuck emotions and toxins. Shifting muscles back to their natural flow, encouraging muscles to release in chain reaction, calmly settling deeper into the pose. And that relaxation, you know, the breathing, the expansion will show us the tense muscles. And I have a smile scan technique that helps you release and relax those parts of the muscles with a smile. So, um, while you can, just go with this and practice with that. And check out the smile scan when you get the chance. So, exhale from tightening the lower stomach muscles. And then stomach muscles. Inhale.
from relaxing the stomach muscles. Inhale from relaxed stomach to deepen the inhale. Exhale gratitude. Exhale more love. Hold it. Relax. Then release. Inhale. Inhale more love. Hold it. Relax. Release. Find your count. Find your movement. Find your practice. Start off small. Start off just doing it. Then try to inhale a little more. Then try to exhale a little more. Then try to relax a little more. Try to hold it a little longer. Try to relax a little bit more. So this is the, the practice that I wanted to share today. Um, may this help you along your way. I love you so much. May you enjoy your day. Be easy on yourself. Be gentle on yourself. Take care of yourself. Inhale that gratitude and that love as much as you can. Expanding. Hold it. Relax. Exhale. Exhale more. And I'll do a few of those big breaths, big breath holds for a little while, and I'll start feeling warm, and I'll start feeling tingly, and then I'll start feeling the stretch, and then I'll just relax, then I'll just stop the breathing techniques, and then just breathe normally, inhale and exhale. This breathing experience can really help you out with a lot of things in your life. You're really expanding your breath, you're really lengthening your breath, and as you do that, your body's healthier, you're expanding and getting out more. As you're relaxing and expanding into it, you're allowing your breath to get even better and stronger every day. And your natural breath becomes bigger and longer and slower. Longer lengths of breath, longer, slower breaths in our lifetime equates to a healthier life. Using those stomach muscles, squishing out that air, pushing that air out, tones our stomach, helps us with our digestion. And with that practice and with that work of continuing, you end up pushing pressure up and releasing pressure down and pulling. And you end up opening and closing your pineal gland and flexing it and relaxing it. And with this technique over and over again, you can get real lightheaded. You can go into a DMT state and start to, start to blast off. So make sure you're in a comfortable spot. If I'm sitting here like that, I don't want to fall over and hit my head. You know, don't want to get damaged. So practice, this is your practice now. Learn, love, be grateful. Thanks, loves.